the next prospect I'm going to go over that has to clear for the WNBA draft, for sure, is Jordan Horston. She's a six foot two inch guard, and I'm going to go from Tennessee. I'm going to go over her stats. 15.6 points per game, 7.1 rebounds per game, 3.3 assists per game, 1.6 steals per game, 1.1 blocks per game, 3 turnovers per game though. That could be cut down some, some. 43.8% from the field, 27.8% from the 3 point line, 24.72 overall. Maybe she could improve that area. Same 3.9% from the free throw line on 115 attempts and 1.9 fouls per game. So, the only thing I could see two areas really that need to be improved, turnovers, but it's lower than the year before. I give her that because last, the year before, last year's 4.5 turnovers per game. Now it's down to three. But granted, the 4.5 turnovers per game were in 23 games though because of injury. So, yeah, I would say three-point shooting and turnovers. But after that, this seems to be a good prospect here, and she might have she might be like a small forward, power forward type player potentially. She could do that if need be. I just don't know about the shooting guard position because the three-point shooting has declined ever since her first true season at Tennessee. I mean thirty. 30%, 27 for 90 overall, 14 for 50, 14 for 50, the, the, her sophomore year, 16 for 58, which is 27.6%. Granted, it did go up by only by 0.2. I mean, that's not a lot of improvement. If she can improve that jump shot from three, maybe that'd be easy, better. And but this year is the highest field goal percentage she's made all her career though. I mean, last year, 37.9%. Her sophomore year, 35%. Her freshman year, 39.4%. It's the highest it's been since her freshman year. So, that's really good news right there. Anyways, if you like this content, like and subscribe, and see you guys on your final subscribers. We're on the road to it. Let's go.